No, are you, do you need a minute? <laughs> How's that for you? Oh. <laughs> that makes my breath nice now. That's nice. You don't have to worry okay. a lot about subjects. Um, I know who you are in the story. Tell the audience who you are in the story. I am Don John, yes. the villain, the villain. of the play. Yeah, and the prin- uh, a bastard son of bastard the son of the prince. Yeah, and, and I, yeah, I sort of felt bad for him. Yeah. I think when I first approached the character, I mean, to humanize him, I actually, I felt bad for him. I was very sympathetic. Yeah, I think you to have to be, don't have, you? You have to be, or I have to be as an actor to come out of character. You have to sort of find this, you know, the human side of him. So yeah. Yeah, I sort of felt that, like the bastard son just breaks my heart. Yeah. 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 So tell me, um, tell me, I, I'm, I'm curious as to know why Shakespeare is so perennial. Why do we keep going back to these stories? Uh, because they are the formulas to which all writers still, I think, draw their storylines from. I mean, I can think of, you know, a bunch of different sort of modern day movies that all draw from I think there was something about Shakespeare he just kind of got it he like he was the first one to sort of grasp these dynamics between human beings um, whether comedy or drama um, and they're just like they're sort of timeless Much Ado being I think one of the more timeless of the plays um, which is why I think this movie works so well is because you know, there's no iambic pentameter and then it's sort of you know to set it in a contemporary uh, setting as Joss did, I think, just works magically. Do you have a particular line of the play you like best? Oh my gosh. Or a favorite moment? I'm giving people an easy out with the favorite moment. Let me think. Um, my favorite line was, I would rather be a canker in a hedge than a rose in his grace. And it better fits my blood to beat. No, I won't. I'll, I won't. Hello. <laughs> that is um, but you saw that. Yes. You know what's going on in that scene, which is not in the original text, which was a little bit of Joss's sprinkling magic. of magic, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.